A sprawling storm has hit the south with high winds and tornado warnings that blew roofs off homes, flipped over campers and tossed about furniture in Florida. Another storm buried cities across the Midwest in more than a half a foot of snow as it heads to the northeast. The National Weather Service says a storm with 55 miles per hour wind and hail moved through the Florida panhandle and into Alabama and Georgia by sunrise Tuesday, along with reports of radar-confirmed tornadoes. At least three deaths were attributed to the storm pummeling the south, with 55 miles per hour winds. A wind gust of 106 miles per hour was recorded before dawn near the coast in Walton County, Florida, near Cottonwood, Alabama, a small city near the Georgia and Florida borders. 81-year-old Charlotte Pascal was killed when her mobile home was tossed from its foundation, the Houston County coroner said. A suspected tornado had touched down in the area.